Okay, this is a homemade Sterling engine that I made in my workshop in the garage. This is a turntable platter off an old turntable that I milled the center out with a milling machine. I used a glass syringe, 30cc, with a chunk of aluminum to mount it, and copper pipe that goes to the displacer. That's aerosol can and two quart paint cans. Got it on top. I got a Watts link up here to keep the motion vertical in the displacer, and made the walking beam. And in here, there's a, what's called a Scotch uh, link, <laughs> Scotch loop, I think it's called, uh, to transfer the rotary motion to uh, reciprocal motion in the piston. So I'll start off and see how it goes. <laughs> Okay. You can see the scotch loop in there. And I put a little oil reservoir here that drips onto the into the cylinder to keep that lubricated. And on the back, there's an extra water reservoir with a drain and two thermometers to keep track of the temperature. And I'm in the process of making a water pump to run off of this to circulate the water through the tank. Made the pillow blocks, the little cranks. And this is tubing out of a little lawn chair. And this is shower wall material. It's like a ceramic stuff that's real nice to work with. You can saw it easily and work with it. And it's real hard and rigid. It's beautiful stuff.